Welcome to Alabama's Smart Yards. We're creating beautiful landscapes that protect natural environments. Why? Because it's a smart thing to do. Today, Brian Brown will illustrate some simple repairs for irrigation spray heads. An annual checkup helps you use water wisely and puts water in its place. If you have an irrigation system in your lawn and you notice dead plants or dead grass, we recommend that you check your system. Spring is a great time to go through each zone of your system and identify any problems such as leaks, clogged sprinklers, or sprinklers that aren't spraying in the proper areas. Irrigation controllers vary, but the basic setup is the same. Check your controller's manual for specific instructions. Turn your system on by rotating the knob to the on manual control position. If your spray heads aren't spraying correctly, they could be clogged. To fix this, pry up the head and then unscrew the nozzle and remove the filter. You may have to flush it out. Replace with a new screen and nozzle and screw the spray nozzle back on. Adjust the head by grabbing the riser and twisting it until it sprays in the proper area. Some brands have adjustable arc nozzles. To adjust those, simply turn it until it sprays in the proper area. To modify the direction of spray rotors, many brands use a special tool designed to adjust the arc of the water. You can find this tool at places that sell irrigation supplies. Turn the head to the right until it stops and adjust the right hand stop by turning the riser. Turn the head to the left and turn the adjustment screw left or right, increasing the spray radius, avoiding undesired areas like sidewalks or your house. Adjusting your sprinklers will ensure that it's spraying in the proper areas and you're not wasting water. 